How big is it? You know, does it come in different colors or anything? The cloud? Yeah. Um, it doesn't come in any different colors. I'm trying to find the cloud. The cloud. The cloud? You guys don't have the cloud? I'm trying to find the cloud? Uh, no. Where is, where is the actual cloud, though? So you guys don't have it in stock here? Nobody does. Nobody has it in stock? Not even right. Apple? Uh, just Apple. You'd have to buy it through Apple. So I have to call Apple? Yeah. Welcome to Apple. How can I help you today? I'd like to buy the cloud. This is Cliff with Apple. How can I help you today? Hi, Cliff. Um, I went to Best Buy to ask about the cloud, and um, they just kept laughing at me and, and told me to call Apple's. Now, do you own other, other devices? Like, a, like an iPhone, an iPad, iPod Touch? Uh, I have a phone. Okay. Was that a grammar problem? No, it's called the iPhone. Okay. I have a phone. Okay. Now, do you have a computer? Uh, no, I don't have a computer. I don't, I don't like computers, actually. Hi, Kathy. Uh, so this is Apple's? Yes, you reached the Apple online store. So you guys have the cloud? Uh, yes. The cloud isn't really something you can buy. I didn't realize it was free. Do you own any Apple products? No, I don't. I'm actually kind of afraid of computers. I don't have any of my own. They kind of scare me. You know, I, I always hear stories how, you know, you can catch viruses from them. And I don't, you know, I don't want to get sick or anything. So I'm, I'm kind of terrified of computers, to be honest. But, but I'm not interested in buying a computer. I okay. just actually want to get the cloud. Yeah, unfortunately, it's not something that you can get independently of any of the, the machines or devices. But I'm, I'm not really interested in the other devices. I just kind of want to yeah. have the, the cloud, though, because I don't really like computers, but I want to, I want to keep it all... Uh, you know, in one spot. Can you tell me, like, how big is it? You know, does it come in different colors or anything? The cloud? Yeah. Um, it doesn't come in any different colors. It's not something tangible, per se. Oh, you <laughs> can't see it. You can buy and put in your hand and touch and feel. It's a remote server. Like, how am I supposed to get stuff from it? Like, if I put some photos in it, and I want to get those photos back, how, how am I supposed to do that if I can't even see it? Well, that's the magic of the individual Apple devices. Okay, so it's, that sounds pretty, it sounds pretty high tech, that it's sort of like invisible and stuff. Now, it, it's, so it doesn't weigh anything, like I can carry it around. Well, that's what I was asking you because I don't know how it works. I don't know the yeah. product specifications. Yeah. It doesn't happen. I, I'm just really confused. Um, hmm. Yeah, it's basically a remote hard drive that you access uh, via your Apple product. Oh, package. okay. So it's a remote hard drive. So that, that makes more sense to me because, you know, like I have a remote for my TV, but it doesn't have a hard drive built into it. But that's basically what it is then. It's like a, it's a hard drive kind of built into a remote that you can carry around with you? No, you can't carry it around. <laughs> I'm sorry. You said it's a remote hard drive? Remote, meaning it's, it's not sitting on your desk with you. Oh, so if it, okay, then where would it be if I don't have it? Okay. Is there is there a refund like if it if it breaks or if it gets dropped or something? If the iCloud breaks or drops? Yeah, is there any kind of a refund? Uh no, the iCloud it's 
not something that breaks or drops. <laughs> oh, wow, that's pretty impressive. Yeah. <laughs> it, so it's never broken yet so far? So far, not to my knowledge. Um, but uh -huh. if, 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 for instance, you know, let's hope this never happens, but let's say my, my place burns down, um, is it, mm -hmm. is it fire resistant at all? I mean, what's it, you know, is, if it goes, if okay, it, it's not a tangible thing. It's not something that you would even keep in your apartment. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Cause I've got, I mean, I've got paperwork and like a filing cabinet no, full no, of stuff. No, no, no. It, it's not like a, a, a a safe, like a lockbox or anything oh, like so, that. Oh, so then how do I get like my photos and documents in, into the, the iCloud device? They would need to be in a digital format. Digital. Okay. Um, all right, so it's basically, okay, so I can't keep it in my apartment. It's not something I can... No, no. I think you're sort of misunderstanding what the entire um, concept is. Oh, that's right, because it's invisible. Right. Okay. So it's on a remote hard drive that I don't have access remote to. Remote server, right. So but where, you where would... Able to store and protect. So, and like I said, it's, it's your digital media. Your okay. digital music, photos, documentation. Um, it's all done wirelessly. I'm sorry, if I'm able to make my uh, document digital and I put it on the cloud, um, mm -hmm. where would the... If the cloud is the remote hard drive, where would the actual remote hard drive be so that I can go get something from it when I need it? You would need one of the Apple devices to retrieve it. It's not like you would go to the cloud store and open up a safe or anything like that. You would access it via your um, Apple device. Yeah, but I mean, where do I go? If it's not in my apartment, where do I go to with that device to to obtain the documents? You like, wouldn't need to go anywhere. You would just have your device and you would retrieve your documents. Okay, but I but if it's not in my apartment, that's what I don't get is where it would be. Your device is in your apartment, right? My the cloud, I haven't purchased it yet. No, if you if you had a device, that's all you would need to access it. Oh, yeah, but I just want to buy the cloud. I don't want a device. Yeah, you can't have, you can't have the cloud without a device. It doesn't work that way. Oh. Well, do you guys sell them as a bundle pack? Like, what, I'm sorry, what device do you sell with the cloud? Like, what if somebody wants to just buy the cloud? Because I don't, I don't like computers. I don't like other devices. Okay, yeah, then I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, we don't offer it by itself. Okay, I have to buy, I have to buy a device in order to buy the cloud. When you buy the device, the cloud comes with it. You don't have to buy the cloud. Can I buy, okay, good. So if I buy, can I return the device and keep the cloud? <laughs> no, you can't, I'm sorry. We're, we're not quite up to that point with the current technology. Okay. I might have to look into something else. Also, you know, I mean, if the other, the other I was kind of worried about getting the cloud and keeping it in my apartment anyways, because, you know, what if there's some eye rain or something? Yeah, exactly. Or even eye snow or a, mm -hmm. an eye hurricane for that sake. Yeah. There's a lot of eye issues with it. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Well, Thank you for your help. I must okay, uh, look I into I've it. I have answered some of your questions. I think you have. Okay, well, great. Thank you for calling Apple. Thank you. Oh, bye. Bye.